having created your maps in MapMate, you'll want to be able to make use of them. And there are various ways of getting the maps from your computer into other documents or onto paper. Once you've opened your species atlas map onto your computer, you can go to the file menu and choose print from here. MapMate gives you quite a lot of control over how you can print your maps out onto paper. You can choose just to print the map that you're looking at, or to print all of the pages in your atlas, in other words, all the species maps. Or you can choose a, any selection of the maps that you wish to use and just print those ones. We'll stick with the All Pages option for the moment. If you then go over to Page Setup, by default what MapMate will do is print one map on each page, and you can choose whether that comes out in portrait format or landscape format, which will give you the largest possible map on your page. Alternatively, you can use the thumbnails option. If you tick this box, you can choose to have a whole set of maps on a single printed page. This makes it quite quick and easy to print out an atlas on paper of all the maps that are on your database. The last set of choices here is to print to file. This is not actually quite as useful as it would appear. It would be handy if you could print direct to a JPEG or direct to a PDF or something, but the only option it gives you in this drop-down is to print as an EPS file, which some printer systems can use, but uh, by no means all. Um, so as I say, that one isn't used as often as it might be. So if we leave that unticked, you'll be printing to paper. And when you click on the print button, MapMate will send your Atlas maps to whichever printer is currently set as your default printer on your computer. That does mean that if you have a PDF writer on your computer and you want to produce your MapMate maps as a PDF document, if you set the PDF writer as your default printer and then click on the print button here, it will direct it to a PDF file. However, if you're just printing onto paper, it'll go to your normal printer, as I said. So. That gives you quite a lot of options for printing to paper. One other thing to be aware of, if you have done, as we have done in this instance, added various keys and other bits of text around the edges of the map, you will have to play around with the gaps and the margins here in, if you want that text to print out in between your maps. It is possible to get it to do so, but sometimes a bit fiddly. So that's printing the maps onto paper. If you want to transfer your maps into a Word document or a PowerPoint slide, one way of doing that is to go to the Edit menu and Copy Map to Clipboard. Having done that, it's now in the computer's memory, and if you go to your Word document and paste, the map will appear straight into that. Once again, you'll see that MapMate doesn't include any of the key or other text here. It only takes what's in the main map box, so if you do need your key to paste into a Word document in this way, you'll need to set it up within the boundary of your map. And exactly the same thing works for the PowerPoint option. We go edit, copy map, open your PowerPoint document, and paste into there. And the MapMate map appears there and can be resized or edited as you wish. One other technique for getting the whole map into a Word document or PowerPoint, including any extra bits of key and so on, is simply to use the print screen button on your computer keyboard. Somewhere towards the top right of the keyboard, you should have a button that says Print Screen, or it might have it in abbreviated form as PRTSCN or something like that. And if you press that button, what it does is to take an image of whatever is currently showing on your computer screen. And if you then go to your PowerPoint document and paste, you'll get an image of the whole screen, including some bits that you probably don't need. But once it's in there, you can use the cropping tool in um, PowerPoint to take off the bits that you don't need and just leave yourself with the map and the key and any other bits of text that you do want. And exactly the same thing can be done into a Word document. So those are the main ways of getting the maps out of MapMate. You can use File Print onto paper. You can use Edit Copy into the memory if you don't need any keys or anything around the edge or you can just use the print screen button on your keyboard to copy the whole screen and paste that into PowerPoint or Word or something similar.